briefly summarize the plot and the character you play. Well, Flora in Ulysses is about this young girl who loves comics. She's very imaginative. She's cynical um, because her family is, is going through this, uh, this new phase where, where the parents have separated and they're trying to navigate that. And, and life has sort of become overwhelming for everyone. And they're, they're sort of the family unit has, has, has a disconnect. Um, and this young girl, Flora, she rescues a squirrel from a vacuum and saves its life and only to discover that the squirrel now has super hero powers and um, and her life changes for, for the better because of, of her new friendship with the squirrel. And, and honestly, uh, Ulysses, the, the squirrel changes their whole family's life for the better. Great, I love it. Okay, cool. Uh, next question, what was, what was it about the story or character that made you want to do this film? I wanted to do this film because I was such a big, I still am such a big fan of the book and, um, and my daughters and I just love it. And then when I read the script, I was thrilled that it, it had everything that I loved about the book um, and more. And so, so I was thrilled that I got to be a, a part of this very special, wonderful project. Great. Okay, next question. What qualities do you share with your character and in what ways are you different? <sighs> the qualities that I share with my character, Phyllis, um, would be, well, we look very similar. Um, so that's one. Uh, I think that, um, like Phyllis, I definitely have a very creative side and I like to really sort of overdo things. You know, if I'm planning a party, I just full on go into it and, and she, she's a romance novel writer. So she thinks like, I'm going to do this period piece. So I must make everything look like that time period. So I can, I can relate to like really trying to just go fully into something and fully commit to it. Um, but where the similarity, similarities end is that I try not to just completely lose sight of the fact that um, I have relationships with other people. And, um, and so I try not to neglect those. Not that she's trying to neglect those, but I think she gets very distracted and so fully in that she, she becomes so consumed, she doesn't see that her life is sort of falling apart around her. <laughs> okay, great. Next question. Uh, what do you think it is about the book that has made it so pop popular with both kids and adults? I think that the, um, the popularity of the, the book Flora and Ulysses is, is probably because of, of how brilliantly um, Kate DiCamillo, the, the author, uh, writes her characters and her stories. And, and she just transports you into these worlds that are, that are so creative and imaginative. And you, I, I know for myself, I just want to live in that world. So I love being able to visit them each time I pick up the books and, um, and I just, I think there's so many different aspects that uh, people can relate to. Uh, so she just, I, I love all of her books and they're all, they're all so different and so incredibly special. Great. And last question, what do you hope audiences will take away from this film? I hope that audiences take away from this film. I hope they take away the, the message of, of, finding hope in their life because when times are dark and, and overwhelming uh, it's sort of the hardest thing to see, but it's what you need the most is to have hope. 